Comedian Dat Fan has arrived, and he's already cracking up the island. We caught up with him at a special appearance at Docomo at the Micronesia Mall. Fan is a veteran comic and winner of the first season of The Last Comic Standing. The Mexicanese, half Mexican, half Chinese. Quan, look out, we're going to the border. What the hell are we? Ijole, Kung Pao Quesadilla. Sweet and sour burrito, what the hell? Dat will be performing two shows tomorrow night, but he has more serious plans for when he's not on stage. I got this, I got this uncle's, look at this. Look how bad this is. I have like a little, it looks like I've been out drinking and eating donuts all night. Eating noodles, I've been eating too much noodles, so I'm gonna try to do some sit-ups, get some push-ups going. At least so my pecs get big enough so I can kind of drape it over like that. All funny business aside, Dat Fan's comedy also has a message hidden between the laughs. Since that I tour all over the world, and um, we want to have more, you know, like we don't want intolerance and ignorance. We want to have people that are involved with, with each other, regardless of race. You know, I know it's a very cliche type of message, but that's really my, my main. Dat's gut-busting jokes made it hard to stop laughing long enough to interview him. That was just a sample. As tomorrow night's show looks even funnier. Expect uh, rice and spam on my show and live crabs. I'll be catching crabs and serving them during the show. <laughs> I don't know. I mean, joking around and, you know, makeup. I'll be put on makeup and lipstick. I'm kidding. <laughs> Those lucky enough to find tickets should be prepared to show up ready to laugh. Keeping you local for Guam News Watch, I'm Kristen Binko.